Hey guys, it's Kersey. Today I decided to introduce you guys to my fan account for Sam Goldback and Kobe Brock. And since it is a Friday and it's only my second video, I decided to just make it into my first series. So every Friday from now on will be a fandom Friday. So fan accounts, fan fiction, fan art, everything related to the shows, movies, and people we love, I will be talking about on Fridays. So today, introducing you to my account, one of my many, this is the only one you'll know about. I'm just going to go and read through my favorite comments. This first one is actually something I posted on Halloween. There's an edit of Kobe and an edit of Sam. And the comment on here, I don't know why I found it so funny. I think it's because it was my first legit comment since I made the account. And it was, it's just a simple, oh my sexiness. Don't know why I found it so funny. I think it's because it's so relatable. Because I have to admit, I did a pretty good job. <laughs> I'm not going to say it was amazing, there are definitely edits and drawings out there that are way better than mine. And those people deserve all the recognition they get and more. But I am proud of what I'm able to do with myself. So that's the first one. Uh, let's go to the second one. Most of the, com most of the comments, I would say 95%. 95%? do make me laugh a lot <laughs> and I've gotten a few here and there that have just made, made me feel better about myself basically which I really f fucking love I'm so grateful for every single person that follows me and person that doesn't follow me because I have a lot of people who like my posts and save them that don't follow me and I advise that you do <laughs> if you're one of those people but at the same time, I'm just appreciative of that fact. Okay. This one is the first, one of the first text posts I made that is away from the series I started. You can pause it if you want to read it. Um, the comment here is just about the caption I made, which you can't see, so I'll just read it out to you. And it says that I was helping my cousin with her newspaper with last night, and this was, remember this was five weeks ago. So I was helping my cousin with her newspaper route, and it was the first Sunday that I went with her. Because she usually has a whole bunch of more people she has to deliver papers to, and she hates being at night by herself. So I went with her, and the whole time we were driving... I kept seeing shadows and faces when she would pass by, and she's she doesn't do scary easily, but well, she doesn't do scary well, so I didn't say anything to her at all, but the end of my caption said that I was convinced my brain was like in 24-7 haunting hour mode, and this girl commented that happens to her too, and she keeps seeing things, and she gets shook, so... Yeah, I was just like, where's Shook Squad? I swear to God, if my house gets haunted, though, I'm suing. And then she just laughed, and that is actually how I made one of my first friends. So she was my first friend. She's really amazing. I love her so much. Oh God, okay. This is another text post I made, and it only has the one part, but it was my first Admin Friday. No. It was my second or third. <laughs> Admin Friday, and I decided to make the post. So, it's a photo of me doing a peace sign after, and the comments weren't related to the actual text post, but they were related to just my selfie. And I just felt so good about myself after these people complimented me. And they're just, they're so nice. They do follow me, and they're the sweetest things ever. They like all my posts, and it's just ridiculous. It just made me so happy, so it's definitely under my favorites. Okay, this one, this girl didn't 
read this. This is part one of the sequel to the first series I had. And this girl didn't read it until yesterday. But she did comment. And she just wanted me to continue. So I told her I was working on part two right now. Cause, because I haven't had much time. And I haven't had the inspiration of what the second part's gonna gonna be about or if it's just gonna be a filler. So I haven't been working on it and it's coming along slowly. But I did tell her I was working on it. She said she was so excited and she thanked me and I have no idea why she said thank you. I don't know if it's because I replied, if I told her that I was working on it, I'm not sure. But she just seemed so nice. And everyone in this fandom is honestly so nice. They are the nicest people I've ever had in my life. And I'm in a lot of fandoms. So, no, she just seemed really nice. She was really excited <laughs> about this. So I might just tag her in it when I put it up. I got one, two, three, four, five golden rings. Give them all to you if you make me your king. This comment, there's nothing extremely special about it except for the fact that this is how I met my new and continuous best friend, Shay. Um, it's an edit. I mean, the app is called Zepetto, and actually, I was introduced to the app by this account I f I follow that I really love, and she started using it. And she got all of us into it, so I made this little, like, photo collage of me and the whole trap house. And the first person that commented, all she said was that it looks really cool, and I said thanks. But that was literally how I met her, because that was how our conversation and our DM started. Like, our conversations started completely because of this app so I really love it she's amazing she's adorable she is literally my best friend right now and she's actually thinking of starting her own channel so when she gets that ball rolling I'm probably gonna start putting the link to her channel down in my description but yeah that's how that's how I met my best friend and I love her to death she's one of the cutest sweetest Funniest people I've ever met. And oh god, okay. This one, this was my first post in general that kind of skyrocketed, especially for the amount of followers I have. I'm definitely grateful for every single one of them, but I'm also a really small account. So the fact that I, and I think I only had about between 130 and 150 yeah I had around 150 followers when I made this post and it has almost 400 likes right now and I just found it so crazy and I made this because Kobe posted about a contest he was having for his merch that whoever bought this koala hoodie on the the day he posted his story about it, someone would win a signed one. And I was really frustrated <laughs> and I felt morally offended because I already bought and had it. Like it's hanging up here in my closet right now. So I already bought it I think a week prior to this day. And I was just really frustrated. So I made this post and it has 12 comments, especially like with me having conversation with people, but I just, I love it because I think about four people commented and they just all, they all related, like they all had the hoodie already when he did this. It's like, this girl up here, I love her. She has like my most favorite comments. It's like my freaking thoughts too, god dang it. And then this one is, I swear to god I liked all of these. Like my freaking thoughts too. And this one just said me. This girl said so she got hers on Thanksgiving, and then two days later he had the contest. And it's just 
like every single person who liked that I was like oh that's why I have so many because they saw this and they could freaking relate to my situation it's ridiculous this one I, I remember how hard I laughed reading this one this is a video edit I made with with the Zepetto characters and it's a transition from Sam and Colby to me and Shay to the four of us for the ending but it was basically the caption says watch out boys as a new duo of best friends in town because we just kept we have our own conversation about how one day we're just gonna be <laughs> bigger than Sam and Colby especially now that she wants to start her channel and this girl commented, Yes, yeah, Sam and Colby, they're coming for you, just like me and Jake are coming for you. And then she put another comment. It's like, wait, that came out wrong. And admittedly, I didn't get it at first. And then once I read the second one, I'm like, oh. This one is definitely my freaking favorite. Because it was last Friday and I was really bored and I had no idea what to post and I didn't want want to just do like a regular selfie for admin Friday and so I made this video transitioning from Colby to me I do shit myself with a whole, with every big crush I get but Colby's my like literally my favorite the absolute best person ever so I made this, because I'm like, I don't know what to post, I don't have a text, I don't want to do like a regular selfie, so let me just do a video going from Colby to me. And this girl commented that she fucking ships it. It was amazing, I loved it so much. Because I was, I was actually going to watch a movie with my cousins when I saw this. I was just really amazed and shocked, because I... I was also shocked by the fact that since I have my thing down as a business page, I can see the insights. I can see like who bookmarks it. And I have 19 bookmarks for that. And I'm like, you have 19 people saved a video of Kobe Brock and like someone they don't even fucking know. So this next one is something I made five days ago. And it's a simple edit, but I feel like it's really my best. I keep stuttering. I feel like it's really my best ones from all the edits I've made on this account so far. And it honestly is my favorite. I'm I'm, I'm probably going to make it my screen, my home screen to be honest. So I made that. And these comments, I didn't think they were like funny or anything. I just, I enjoyed them. And it's just that the first one, the girl looks like she can be between 8 and 10, which is definitely younger than you should be able to have Instagram. And she said, hell yeah, so I was just, I was just thrown back by the fact that this girl who looks like she could be eight is on Instagram liking a shirtless picture that says, feel like making a deal with the devil, but you, know, you do you, honey, you do you. This one was just a lot of, you know, they just love the comments because the boys are moving out of the house they're in right now. And they haven't specified whether they're all moving together or they might get their own places because I have heard from other people, apparently Sam and Colby don't want to stay in California forever. So we didn't really get any details aside from the first date. And I'm pretty sure it's just a new house, but I made the video anyway because either way, it's the very first trap house. It will always be the first trap house. That's where they have all these memories together. So it was worth making a video of. I made the video and then I made a text edit. And the comments, I suck at making sad edits unless I'm making jabs at myself, which is, is bad. <laughs> but it's good. Like, it's fun for me. And it was just everyone, like, laughing at it. And then this one person whose username I can really freaking relate to said this scarily resembles my relationships and I just found it funny because I have like six different people talking in this text in this text imagine and the whole thing relates to her relationship. I'm like oh, okay. So this one right here it's actually gonna be the last one because this is 
the most recent post I have with comments on it. And I, I didn't know what to post. I know I wanted to do a text thing. I wasn't sure what. So I revolved it around Jake being mad at his friends for something stupid and just being really dramatic. And I really enjoyed it. I do make myself laugh reading it. And the comments here make me happy because of the fact that a couple of people did say that I captured Jake, Jake Weber perfectly. It sounds like something he'd do. And it just made me really happy. And then there was this one that just said, look at Kobe's face. It's amazingly cute and hilarious. And I'm like, I know, I love it so much. And then she just replied with like this smiley face with his tongue st sticking out, which I don't understand. But the other two just made me really happy. I was glad I was able to actually capture him. I'm glad, like, I can capture these characters as perfectly as possible. And that was the last one. So I want to thank you guys for clicking and watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, make sure to subscribe and comment. So you can give me all your suggestions, and I'll go through them and put them in my next video. I love you guys so much. Thank you once again for watching this, and I can't wait to see you next week. Bye.